Hey guys, you watch my real life vlogs. Wait, actually, no, this is Vlogmas. Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day One. Hey you guys, so before we get into this first installment of Vlogmas, I'm so excited. I wanna catch you guys up on a few updates around the house, right? I haven't done any housework videos, favorites, autism mom updates, or any of that. So let's start with a quick housework update. You guys see me here installing these cordless blinds in my kitchen. Y'all, I'm so excited about this. You know we got these windows replaced over the summer and they have been without window treatments all that time. So we are finally covering them. This is a faux wooden cordless blind that I got from Home Depot. This is the Home Decorators Collection. Y'all, this was mad easy to put up and it really looks like a nice professional finish when you're done. And the doorknob of this back door used to be an oval shape and I couldn't get that toddler safety handle on there. So I went ahead and replaced that for a round one and it's working out perfectly. No more of Anne escaping the house at 3 a.m. to play on her playset. <laughs> Another thing about these blinds is that they can be cut right in the store to fit your exact dimensions. So honey, for the price and easy installation, I'll take it. Went through all this trouble to get the blinds up and I never even closed them but anyway moving into the family room you guys remember what the window treatments looked like before they were really amateur looking I had no idea what I was doing and I was cutting off my arches making my windows look smaller so I decided to take you guys as advice thank you all so much for the constructive criticism you guys gave me a lot of direction on how to do this so I decided to hang them high and wide and y'all I absolutely love the way these turned out the windows look stunningly gigantic now and really complements the arches the drapes themselves are faux velvet pottery barn dupes that I I ordered from Amazon. Another update that I want to give you guys before we get into the content is um, about Anne's hair. And the reason I wanna give you guys these updates before we get into it, because as you're watching, you're gonna see the new window treatments, you're gonna see Anne's hair, and you're gonna have questions. So I just wanted to get it kind of out there in the forefront. So Anne is getting locks, you guys, yay! So we are getting these started with the two strand twist method, and we're really excited, as you can see. I'm just hoping that these will take and we'll get the results that we're looking for. I definitely want her to have some juicy locks. As you can see here, you guys, we're having a little lunch. Anne is getting mad restless, y'all, so I'm trying to just have her relax because this did take a while because your girl had to take her time. I wanted to make sure that her parts were straight. I didn't want to rush it. I wanted to make sure we had the right sizing, but now we're all done, and um, I'm just gonna finish up with a little bit of oil for style and shine, and Anne really loves the movement and stuff, you guys, but listen, let me tell y'all why I decided to do this. I've kind of been toying with the idea for a couple years now, but I decided to go ahead and you know get it off the ground because my daughter has some really severe sensory issues with her scalp for some reason and I really hated to see her so miserable every time it was time to get her hair styled and I'm not gonna not style her hair because I want her to look pretty so we had to come up with a solution it's been like a week so far and I do intend to take you guys along the duration of the journey but y'all Anne loves it so far all right that's it for now Vlogmas came around quick. Y'all, thank you. Thank you so much for tuning in. I wanted Thanksgiving Day to be the start of Vlogmas. So we're kicking off Vlogmas. What does that mean? That means I'm posting a video every single day in the month of December. I look a mess. Y'all, I've been up since 7 o'clock cooking in the kitchen. All my food is done, though, and it's 1 o'clock, so I'm happy about that. There's Anthony. You want to say hi, huh? We look a mess. Uh, What's up, you guys? Yeah, look kind of your right your now. your hair is done. My hair is not done. Uh, we kind of look a mess right now, but we're gonna get it together. Yes, I'm about to actually wash my hair right now. I took my braids out and everything, and yeah, you know I've just been a little cooking busy bee this morning, starting last night. Vlogmas, it's going down. It's going down. 2021. Let's get it. <laughs> All right, so Moon was here. She just loved to go get some last minute stuff. My father-in-law is downstairs chilling. I got tons of family coming over here. Anne is up here in her pajamas. Honey, we're getting it together though. Let me show y'all a quick little tour. Quick Thanksgiving kitchen tour, food tour. So here's the dining room. All right, it's giving very much so Christmas slash Thanksgiving harvest. So this is kind of what I did with the decor this year. We went with the gray checkers. Lots of candles. I told Anthony, I'm thinking I'm hitting a world record this year for candles. It's probably like 60 candles all out. It's really pretty bad. And this is my dessert station, y'all. I decided to use my little three-tier dessert displays that I got from Amazon. I'm obsessed with them. I will always find a reason to use them. So we just got some bread pudding here. This is the Patty LaBelle um, desserts. And then some cookies, ginger cookies and all of that. 
Got my candles here. I got my Patty LaBelle sweet potato pie. Y'all don't talk about me. I don't bake. I don't bake at all. And then I did make these vegan cranberry oatmeal cookies. So delicious. And then some more macaroon type of cookies. So that's my dessert area. This is the other dining table that I went ahead and decorated. Tried to make as much seating as possible. This is what's going on in the family room. As y'all see, we got some new curtains and stuff. Father in law. Hey. <laughs> he Happy chilling. Thanksgiving, everybody. Yes. yes, yes. Look at you looking good. Oh! Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, my father in law do not be playing. He don't be playing. Yes. So who's playing on the um Oh, okay, okay. Here's my bird sitting there resting. I got my exotic delicacy in this pan or this pot. My chitterlings. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, if you don't eat chitterlings, that's fine. You know, exotic delicacies are not for everyone. And then we have some turkey greens, some smoked turkey um, greens. Then I have my drink station here. So Alex is going to get the stuff for the punch and everything. But I tried to set it up where you can start here. Fix your plate, fix your plate. We're going to carve the turkey and put it in there. And then as you come around here and you finish up, this is where you get like your toppings and condiments and you know, your cornbread and all that stuff. And then so far I made the mac and cheese, yams, turkey dress, and I'll show you guys what it looks like later. And then my aunties are bringing some additional foods that hopefully will fit right here. So, yep, this is what the um, countertop is looking like. I wanted to put some additional seating. And since I had the extra like plate settings, I just went ahead and put the stuff out. Like I got tons of plate settings. I'm like, we might as well put it out. So it's seating for 13, which should be good to get us started and Mumu made me some avocado sam smoked salmon toast before she left so I'm gonna finish eating that so yeah I'm gonna go and actually wash my hair because I took my braids out last night and it's looking bad but don't worry I'll be I'll get cute really soon but yeah I'm gonna go do my hair and then me and Alex got to get a quick workout in so we can justify all of this eating and then we'll start our Thanksgiving <laughs> Okay, right here you guys we're doing a little workout tag team I love working out with my sis it's the best I'm basically just copying a bunch of stuff that we do at my gym I do attend um, like a UFC type of gym and we do nothing but hit like that's basically what the program is so um, this is just one of the routines that we've done before where we'll do 30 seconds of a particular exercise while the other person is jumping rope and then um, you switch off and just do it again so there really are no breaks your break is the jumping of the rope or the exercise whichever one you see as um more of a break but yeah um, my sister was looking at her apple watch and we had burned about um a little under 200 calories in just 25 minutes so i would say it was a pretty good workout <music> Anyway, that was a great workout, you guys. 
I feel amazing. I'm so glad I did that. Turn on this light. Ooh, we didn't got blowed out. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Y'all look at my eyebrow. Like, I hate, it's always this one. I hate when it does that. Get back up there. There we go. Y'all probably like, she crazy. Anyway, that workout felt great. Look how I'm sweating. Amazing. 25 minutes. Well, 27 minutes is what it was. I was shooting for 30. So good. Ugh, amazing. So anywho, I'm about to get in the shower, rinse the conditioner out of my hair, um, and then go ahead and move forward with my styling. Okay, y'all, I'm ready. Ponytail activated. I actually really like the way it turned out this time. It's not too long. It's got a good feel to it. All the hair is blended very nicely, so I kind of like it. I used a different type of hair, um, so none of that silky stuff. Anywho, this is kind of the look. We're going with tan plaid tights kind of look it's giving very much so thanksgiving harvest fall vibes <laughs> let me show y'all the bottom so this is kind of the look i decided to go for quirky so we're doing gucci down with the tights and then this skirt this cute little plaid skirt y'all and this is actually a bodysuit and it feels like cashmere ish and I got these pieces from uh, Macy's. So yeah, that's the look. Y'all hear my family downstairs. It's cracking. Let's go downstairs and see everybody. <laughs> the Hulk is out. Okay, this is how everything turned out. Look how pretty. I told y'all, world record with the candles. Yeah. Y'all know my cousin. Hey, who's that? Yeah. Hey, Sierra. Oh, look at my auntie with her grandbaby. I know, right? <laughs> oh, so sweet. Uh-uh, look at him. <laughs> they running the mug, boy. They will. You know what I'm saying? That's good. They will. They will. They will. My auntie Felicia. Oh, but on her, on her diaper bag. Look how, look how cute her hair is. I just want my hair to be like that. I just want I want mine to look just like that. Here's here's Mumu. Check it out, Mumu. <laughs> Anthony and Ann. I know. Look, Ann. Me and Ann coordinating a little bit. We got on similar colors. We put her punch together. It's a, some kind of cranberry punch. I feel like she always does this for like holiday, Christmas, Thanksgiving. And then let me show y'all how my chitlins turned out. I ended up breaking them down. My auntie showed me how to break them down. Yeah, this is my first time cooking them all by myself. So, ooh, they look good. I didn't even show y'all. My auntie brought some um, oyster dressing. I'm supposed to show y'all the mac and cheese. Yams. My dressing. I just did like a traditional turkey dressing. <laughs> oh, yes, now, honey. Okay. Let's see, getting it cracking over here. Yes. I know. Hey, Auntie Didi. You look so cute. Okay, Auntie, I see you over here. I see you. Other Auntie over here. I see you. Thank you. Look at here, look at here. Lord. Y'all need anything? Y'all need some wipes? What up, what up, family? There a, um, a football game on, right? Uh, I know the Bears played early. All the Raiders at Cowboys. Annie. <laughs> What up, cuz? What up, cuz? <laughs> 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 
Hey y'all. This is the big church you had. You say the next day. Two hours to go home. Two hours to go home. Hey! 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 Thank y'all for coming, everybody. All my family, I'm so happy to see everybody. Like, I don't even know. It's all well. I'm so grateful for all of y'all. I love y'all so much. I know my cousin Annie was here. My sister Beach was scared. She would be so happy to see the family all together like this. <laughs> Thank you so much for helping me and coming over here. And my auntie Patsy, have a whole thing always helping out, always showing up, coming through, bringing the food. You know, it's going to be delicious. So I'm just so excited. I want us to um, begin with a little prayer. Okay, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Yes. Father, first, we repent. Yes. If anything, Lord, forgive us. Yes. But thank you for this home that allowed us to be here today. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Thank you for the ones who came out. Yes. Thank you for the food that was prepared. Yes. Let it become nourishment for our body. Yes. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 So I'm thankful for everybody coming out. I'm thankful for us combining the families. We got the Morris, the Cole, Quincy Johnson, Golas, uh, family and friends. I'm glad you guys came as well. I mean, friends, glad you guys came as well. Uh, Thankful for the kids. Thank you for my baby. Go life. Thank you. She put a big toe in. <laughs> Watch out. I literally she put a big toe in. Um, aunties, thank y'all for helping out. We really, we really appreciate y'all. And let's be fast with my marriage. Let's go. Okay. And what you doing? Everything. You chilling, mommy? Uh, you chillin' mommy. <laughs> Look, baby. job. I really love that. A plus. I'll be right back. But it's something, it's something extra in there though. Look at my cousin Keisha. I love Sansa. Sansa. What is it? What is it? Sansa. 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 I gotta get it right. I gotta get it. I miss hey, you so much. I miss you too. I'm so glad you came. Oh my god. I had to. Yes. It's it is nice out here. It's all right. Sometimes I feel like I, I wish my yard was a little smaller. You always, it's all the grass is always greener. I always was like, oh, I gotta have a big yard and all this, but it's not cozy. But it's a heavy dog. 
Girl, she is just thickety thick. She wanted me to hold her hand. Yeah. Uh -huh. girl, you yeah. She is such a baby. It's, we spoiled her. She's such a baby. All right, a little family time in the back. Nah, it ain't no family time. Auntie, we getting money right now. What? Niggas over here, they probably hit it. Let's get it, bro. Let's get it, bro. Let's get it, bro. Let's get it, bro. I love that hoodie. I love this hoodie. Don't you love it? Okay. Yeah. We in the backyard chilling with the fire. Ooh. Man, let me smoke the weed. Let me get the lighter. Man. Matter of fact, I'm smoking this. It's electronic. I don't hey. even need a lighter. Hey. When I hit the beat, that shit be fire. Hey. On the real, check out my attire. Uh, Royalty you know I'm trapping. Man, you know I'm trapping. Man, you know my cuss. Uh, you know I'm trapping. 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 He was so crazy, don't hold back. Oh, see, he was coming back like retro, like he was a throwback. Let go, he was building up like Legos. Oh no, that boy was like Tony the Yeah Yo, moving mm. like he was in G Unit. He was trying to see through it, yeah, like oh. it was nothing but saran wrap. Uh. They don't give a about that. We had yeah, to amend that. Let's do that. Shit. Okay. <laughs> You already know. Hey, no, I don't want to eat the weed. I don't smoke. I don't joke. No, I do. I fucking joke. Black. Fuck it. We're going to fade him like the black. Fuck it. We're going to do yeah. him like the jack. Yeah. 21 we, to his chest. We're going to smoke him like the jack. Ridiculous. We're going to smoke him like the black. Ooh. Fuck it. We're going to smoke him like a black. Hey. Boy, these niggas all cap. I'm going to call these niggas hats. It's all right. I am fucking Okay, okay. Hey. Hey. <laughs> she missed her. Oh my god. I She is over there. Oh, 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 Auntie, look at you. Look at your ass at the end right here. Look at you. Hey, Auntie Felicia in the house. She just come in out the door. She said, What y'all doing out here? I'm trying to hit some more. Ooh. She's like, I'm ready to go in the house, actually. This is my little cuz. He's gonna be vlogging for the next few minutes, okay? Isn't he so handsome? I'm gonna go up and see him too. Here. Yes, let's go. Okay, Does anyone want to see? Cuz, you ain't see my house. Come on, come on. Look at my house. Now, now, listen. Don't talk about my junkiness, okay? Okay. I was too busy trying to figure out this cooking situation. I ain't cleaned up nothing. Come on. <laughs> no. You do. You look for the ginger beer. Let me explain something to you. When we moved in this house, my dad was like, what do you mean? <laughs> I, he helped me with everything. Yes. Every closet in here. My, okay, let me explain something to you. We had some guys to come and paint, mm -hmm. and we needed to finish some spackle that was going on in the lounge room. Mm -hmm. Do you know that my dad came over here at 4 o'clock? Well, he was here till 4 o'clock in the morning fixing that so it could be done for him to come paint. Mm -hmm. When I tell you, I was just like, any, that's my number one. Mm -hmm. That's the king. That's my number one. See, that's Anything he asked me to be done. Can't nobody tell me nothing about my dad. Come Let me on, tell you something. So he helped us with so much stuff in here, and he taught me how to do Beautiful. stuff, and I was able to do it. Mm -hmm. All the blinds downstairs, I installed those Remember myself. Remember the furnace? Yeah. Yep. I he told you. I do remember what the front. Oh. The AC went out, baby. <laughs> and I was so scared. I called the repair people. I had they, oh, you got to get a new one. It's going to be $7,000. So I paid it. Mm. And then I called my dad, like, hey, dad, so you know, I just bought an uh, AC unit. He, how much you pay for it? Mm. I said, oh, $7,000. What the? <laughs> so mad. He said, you called him right now. You cancel that. Yeah, and he sent right. his friend over here who know how to do yes. AC repairs. Oh. Yes. I had a new I had a new thing going on for $185 See? versus $7,000. Yeah, we in your room. In your room, Ian. Oh, he looking for he died. All right, all the kids are lining up. All the kids are lining up. I do. Wait, what's it called? It's called Miss Mom TV. Y'all say one. I count to three. Say, say hi. Say hi, subscribers. One, two, three. Hi, hi subscribers. Ooh, y'all so cute. I love y'all. Okay. You know she wants to be famous. Oh my God. Everyone, say, say, say who you are. Say your name. My name is. Who are you? Hey. I'm Who are you? Look at these beautiful oh, names. Uh-huh. This is my little love. My little speed love. Give me a kiss. I know y'all heard that too. She said her speech out here. Okay. okay, we about to go get cookies and water. Come on, Ian. Come on, Ian. Come on, Ian. Follow me, little children. Follow me, children. Look how cute. Look how cute. Come on, little kids. Here's here's the 
cookies options, you guys. Come on, park you later. Hey, 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 go, Auntie. Let them know, Auntie. You let them know, Auntie. Yeah. Hey, 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 go, cuz. <laughs> We've been trying to put together a TikTok for the last two hours. <laughs> this is all we got. We just, we still chilling. We still chilling. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Sierra! I can't even show y'all who this was who just walked in, but comment your best guesses. Hey! Hey! What up, what up? Alright, listen to this TikTok. Hey. I'm gonna show my TikTok. baby good morning you guys it is the next day Ooh, vlogmas is gonna be a trip this year anywho it's officially christmas for me i like to get through thanksgiving before i start any sort of major christmas efforts so i am just sipping some coffee this morning we definitely slept in you guys i didn't wake up until close to nine o'clock which is definitely sleeping in i'm sitting here right now having some leftovers okay and yeah we'll go up to a clean house pretty much because last night my family basically helped me clean up all of the major stuff in the kitchen washed all of the pots and pans and um after everybody left i was kind of restless so i just went ahead and mopped the floor which wasn't even that bad i want to say my halloween party was way worse this compared to my Halloween party, it was just not even close. So I was really happy about that and kind of surprised because it seemed like there were a lot of people in here, but it just really didn't get that messed up. So that was good. And um, today, it's just me and Ann. Well, my father-in-law still sleep up in the guest room, but Anthony is at work and um, Ann didn't have any. That's awesome. Walking around, trying to get some leftovers. Um, Ann's therapy center was closed today, um, so she's here with me, and we're gonna get some errands ran today because I kind of want to, actually I have a lot to do today. I kind of want to decorate my house a little bit, so I need to run to like the home decor store and just type some loose ends, and we need to drop off a plate to Anthony's grandma that she wasn't able to make it last night. So me and Ann are gonna do that, and I actually have an event to go to tonight I don't know if I'll share that in this vlog because it might be too long. There's an event at the Womanish exhibit and I was invited out as an honoree for being like, I guess like um, an influential person for Chicago. So it's gonna be other women there being honored as well. So I'm gonna bring Alex with me and we're gonna slide through that. And it's kind of my day. 
But so yeah, back to last night. So much fun, y'all. That was one of the best Thanksgivings I've experienced in my adulthood. It was really fun. Sunset's going upstairs. I can hear her feet. Um, yeah, it was really great. Not me eating chitterlings. <laughs> I don't feel no type of guilt about eating this because I've been working out really well. I actually probably try to get a work in, in workout in this afternoon. I don't feel no type of way. And y'all, for the first time, I was really nervous last night about the food because my dad's sisters are like legit cooks. And when it comes to soul food, you better be coming correct, honey. It's got to be correct. I was actually nervous, but my auntie Felicia, as you guys saw, got in there and was really helping me figure this thing out. You know, putting the finishing touches on everything and making sure stuff was correct. This was my first time cooking chitterlings all by myself. I don't know if I told y'all that. So, um, last year, I think, I want to say my mom helped me with them. Like, she was kind of, she was pretty much cooking them and I was just trying to learn. But this year, I was all by myself doing it. But my auntie helped me, like, with the finishing touches. So now I feel like I have it mastered. I legit feel like I have it mastered now. So I was nervous for it to turn out right, but it was great. Everybody really loved the food. Plates were empty. That's always the best part when you've cooked a meal and you see empty plates. It's always good when you don't see any plates face down in the garbage and all that kind of stuff. So people definitely seem to enjoy. But if it wasn't for my aunties, like, making sure everything was right, I probably wouldn't have gotten through that. <laughs> And I know some of you guys are gonna ask um, about my mom being here. I know that some of that is drama mongering. I know some people like to stir up conversations to bring negativity to the forefront. So I do realize some of that is going on, but I also know that some of y'all just genuinely um, enjoy my family and you just wanna know where people are. And I appreciate you, not that other stuff. But yeah, unfortunately my mom doesn't get along with my dad and or his side of the family. Um, this wouldn't be the first or the last time you guys heard of this kind of scenario. We are your average family in every sense, in just about every sense. So unfortunately, sometimes I have to choose if I'm gonna be hanging out with my mom or my dad because they had a very kind of nasty divorce and it's just what it is. I'm not gonna be on here telling my family's business and stuff, but just letting y'all know that's why my mom wasn't here. I really loved having the families blended, because it wasn't just my dad's side here, it was also Anthony's side. It was his mom and his dad's side here. And then just generations, we got new new babies being born and stuff like that. So it was a fantastic evening. I got to see a lot of my first cousins on my dad's side. All of the older women that you guys saw were pretty much my dad's sisters. And they are just such a close family, y'all. They're the reason that we're close, me and my sisters, because they're just really the epitome of closeness in a family. It's something to behold. They've been through a lot and they hold each other up. And I just love to see it. So a lot of my philosophies about family closeness, I just believe it came from what I saw growing up. So anyway, I'm gonna finish up here. Um, Anne's finishing up her breakfast and then we're gonna start our day. <laughs> Even if it's 11.30 a.m. <laughs> Miss the days when I used to be able to just get up, put on my coat, and walk out of a door. <sighs> All right, Annie Burger, let me grab your coat. Y'all, Anthony always turns the Christmas lights off every morning when he leaves out for work, which is at like 4 a.m. And I always wake up very disappointed because I'm like, I want to see this when I wake up. Like, 
I want to see Christmas lights. I don't want them to ever turn off, really. Here, Anne, let's put your coat on, sweet girl. Let's put your coat on. Put your pretzels down. Put those pretzels down, Anne. You can't do both. So, yeah, we're on our way. Just tie my shoelaces to drop off the food to Granny. We're running a little bit behind schedule because I like to show up at people's houses when I say I'm going to show up, not too early and not too much later after that. So we are a little bit late, but um, hopefully it'll be okay. And I got to quickly get back here to get myself ready for this evening. So I'm going to go ahead and do this special delivery, okay? And I'm gonna end this vlog here because you guys gotta stay tuned for tomorrow. And I'm definitely gonna take you guys along to the Womanish exhibit where I'm going to be honored. And I'll share that experience with you guys and we'll see what else we get into. So I will see y'all tomorrow. It's Vlogmas. Videos every day, let's get it! <laughs> Bye.